three days ago, I caught a swarm in my swarm trap. And now look, they can't be swarming again. They just got there. I knew I was hearing buzzing when I was working on the Subaru. However, I didn't see anything at first, initially. I mean, but now, so could it be that was a uh, virgin and she went out to get mated and now she's coming back? It's one o'clock in the afternoon. There's no external big activity here. The weak hive, no big activity. Yellow hive, the first swarm that I caught over here, nothing. And the hive back here, nothing really. That hive right there, nothing. I mean, just, you know, regular bees coming and going. However, look at this. Unless those bees that were there was a scout bees and now they're finally moving in. Maybe that's what it was. Those scouts were holding the place and uh, from somewhere they came. So it looks like they're all landing and moving in. Yeah, I think that's what's going on. The bees are, are the whole swarm is moving in. So they're not coming out, they're going in. I'm gonna stand here and watch this for a minute. Holy smokes. Well, how about that? Today is what, Monday, May 8th? And uh, I thought the swarm had already moved in. Apparently not. Apparently it was like just the moving crew. <laughs> so now we got bees. I'm standing in the middle of the bees here with just my regular clothes on. No veil, no hat, no anything. No bee jacket. I'm gonna sit down in my chair here. I know I heard buzzing and I stopped working and came out here and looked. I didn't see anything. Like five minutes ago, there was nothing. And then uh, I was I was fixing the jack on the car, uh, getting ready to make sure I was safe, jacking the car up, doing the maintenance. And uh, the roaring got louder and louder. And uh, lo and behold, we got bees moving in. Okay, wow. And here I was thinking I was just gonna give them an extra week. Um, but I guess I'll write on my calendar, today's the day they moving in. First time I ever caught the, the bees moving into the hive. Uh, the first swarm that I caught, I didn't see them move in. It was just a couple of days and and then I saw bees. So, okay. I wish, I wish the camera was able to pick up all the bees that are, uh, let's see my finger here, flying around over in this area behind the red hive. They're just all flying around trying to get to the box. And, and the bees here, they're not even bothered. They don't even care what's going on over, right? Right behind their heads. 
Look at that. Oh my, oh my. It's Monday afternoon. Um, like I said, May 8th, I believe the date. I'll verify the date, 2023. And uh, these ladies are moving in. Now, some people may think that up there and those things, those are bees, those are not bees. That's a, um, a knot in the tree. We have a couple of trees here. You can see a knot there. Um, you can see a knot there. Those, are, those aren't bees. They're defects in the tree. Uh, we have a couple of trees in our area with that same defect and I don't know if it was some sort of uh, uh, I, don't, I don't know um, We haven't had an arborist out, but there's like six or eight trees in the area with that same defect in in those certain areas, so uh, But yeah, they're not they're not a swarm of bees but That is a swarm of bees My running commentary sucks, but but I'm I'm just I'm sitting in my chair in my apiary, just taking it all in. I'm supposed to be doing mechanical work, replacing the drive shaft on our Subaru. Uh, however, I got distracted, and it was a great distraction. They're moving in. I guess it's better than moving out, right? <laughs> I didn't I didn't want to see another another swarm move out of any of our own our hives, so. With these, with these bees moving in, uh, yeah, that's something. Look at the bearding hanging down, and there, there. Hopefully, the queen will get in, and they'll get settled down. It looks like there's less and less bees flying, and more and more bees that are uh, that are landing and, and trying to work their way in. Let's see how close I can. There we go. As you can see, the hole is in the middle of all of those bees. And uh, since I caught this on, it's about a, almost eight minutes now, but it, it was happening about, I say I, I heard it about a minute before I, I ran and got the camera, maybe two minutes before I, I went and got the camera to a uh, video. So, like I said, these bees will, will do what they want to do and show you what they want to show you and trick you as much as they can. I don't know. <laughs> this is only my fourth year, so, you know, I am no way an expert at, at beekeeping. Um, I, I enjoy having them. Um, I hope they're doing something positive for the environment. Uh, however, I, I don't proclaim to be uh, the, a great, the greatest beekeeper at all. I'm a tinkerer. I love to, to do things my own way, so to speak. And, and I guess I, I'm like a bee that way. The bees want to do things their own way as well. So I guess they just had some cousins move in, check the neighborhood out, go back and report and they told everybody, yeah, those are some cool people. Let's go over there. And the rest of them showed up like Cudden Pete. <laughs> <laughs> Cudden Pete. Anyway, okay. It, the activity seemed to be dying down uh, as most of the bees seemed to be landed already on the, um, let's see. There's still a few, you know, out in the area over, where is it? over here there's still a few bees flying around and they're orientating and flying there you know however wow so most of them are landing and right now i'm coming upon the 10 minute mark of this video and uh 
Yeah, the, the, it's, it's subsiding. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go on and go back to, uh, go back to what I was doing with the car to repair the car. Um, and then I'm gonna come back as soon as I finish repairing the car, I'm gonna come back and show this hive again. There's a hornet trying to get in on the right hand side about midway up the bees. Pretty much even with the hole, but on the outside of the bees. I slowed it down. It'll come into view right there. It's big. Oh, there's something big. Ooh, let's see. I don't know what it was, but there was something big, like a hornet type of thing, also trying to chase it chase the bees but they just kind of chased it away I don't see it anymore but I know hornets they can't get into my regular hives with the um, with the hive gate on there so but that has just a round round hole opening and if it were to get inside, you know, it, it could walk right in. It would fit. However, it won't fit through the hive gate. That blue thing on the front of, I even have it here on the front of, all of my hives have that. Even the hive I'm building my daughter has the hive gate. Okay, I got distracted. Um, I'm gonna go ahead on and uh, work on the car. And I'm gonna come back and visit these bees as soon as I finish. It shouldn't take me but maybe 45 minutes to change out the drive shaft, knock on wood. Hopefully I don't have any issues. All right, that's it for now. I'll be back. Real quick. Just wanted to show a side view of the bearding. Because I know you probably couldn't tell when I was sitting front. That's a side view of the bearding. I'm standing right beside the uh, boat engine. And uh, still a lot of activity. But they're still going in. Hopefully the queen got in. Anyway. All right, so. I'll come back to these after I finish my mechanical stuff. Okay, bee fans. It's been exactly one hour since the last video I showed of this, this hive. The activity has calmed down quite a bit, quite a bit. Now they're coming and going and looks like I'm seeing some orientation flights. I've got a bee in my water tank here. I gotta get that. I put some straw and stuff in this water tank that I run my, my boat engine in. However, the bees still find it. I'll get them out. I'll fish them out in a minute in a sec. I just wanted to show that. So apparently they must have moved in. Or moved out, moved back in. I have no clue. Uh, but that's what bees will do for you. Anyway, all right. Let's, let's, let's zoom in here. It's a big difference from what it was before. And they all went in went in so all right later fam